lots of flowers. Hmm, they smell so good. They are the most beautiful part of the plant. Yeah, they look so lovely. I love flowers. Let's make a flower by magic. You can do anything. Not everything, but I can make a flower. Let's start. Yeah, let me first bring some sepals. You know, these sepals protect the bud till it opens. Sepal protects bud of flower till it opens. Now bring petals, most beautiful part of flower. Aren't they attractive? Yes, they are. They attract insect towards the plant. Petal attracts the insect towards a plant. Here comes the filaments. Bring few anthers too. Oh yeah. These filaments and anthers are male parts of the flower. Jointly, these are called stamen. Male parts, stamen, anther and filaments. Now comes the female parts. Female parts are stigma, style and ovary. Oh, I know. All these female parts are called carpal. You're right. Also put nectar here. Oh, I forgot. Here it comes. Let me show you something. Wow, these are so bright. You know, why flowers are so bright? So that garden looks beautiful. <laughs> You're right. But they are also bright so that they can attract insects and birds towards them. If birds and insects won't come, the anther won't fall in stigma. It is not anther. These are pollens which are there on anthers. What is pollen? Jimmy, these are powder-like things. They get stuck to insects' wings. And then pollen falls on stigma. From stigma, it goes into style. From there, it enters ovary where there are small eggs. Pollen and eggs combine together to make fruit. My teacher told me that this is called pollination. Correct. This pollen entering ovary is called pollination. And fruits and seeds are made because of this. So new seeds are made due to pollination. Pollination is very important. And due to pollination, new seeds are made. And new plants come to the world. Oh see, a bee is coming to drink the nectar. See, some pollen is sticking on her wings. Oh, now it has fallen down in stigma. Oh, these are seeds in the fruit. Yes, from these seeds only, new plants come up. Oh, if I eat them, then plants would come in my tummy. <laughs> no, seeds needs water, sunlight and nutrients from the soil to grow. Let me put it in the soil. Yeah, a plant would come out after a few days. Can't you do it today? Mm, okay, let me try. Oh, flowers are very useful. Yes, you get beautiful flowers, fruits and seeds for the new plants. Eh, eh, flowers give us fruits and seeds for new plants. Let's see something more. Oh, this is sunflower. Why it is called sunflower? Because its shape is like a sun. Oh, this is moving. Yes, plants show movement. See the sunflower move as per sun's directions. Do all plants show movement? Yes, all plants show movement, but we can see most of them. Eh, eh. Plants move as per sunlight. Can you show me some other plants which shows clear movement? My magic wand would show this. 
okay. Try to touch it. Oh, it shrinks. I think it is shy. Yes, if you touch this, it shrinks. That is why it is called touch me not. Let us revise now. Male parts are anthers and flymans. Female parts are stigma, style and ovary. Yes, when anther fall in stigma, it goes down to ovary, where reaction happens and fruit is made. Now, I can also make fruit from flowers. I would take anther and would put it in stigma and fruit would be made. <laughs>